Hello, I'm Sandra Philosoff Shipper, and I'm the new deputy leader of the BC Libertarian Party, a registered party since 1986. We strongly oppose the taxpayer funded per vote subsidies that establishment parties receive. We are not petitioning to receive them as well. We want them canceled immediately. Their very existence demonstrates a disdain for voters, small parties, independent candidates, and taxpayers alike. I ask you, what is the status of democracy if the race is rigged against other viable political options? Political party must function within the confines of the donations it raises. It's not the taxpayer's job to fund any party's ads and events, etc. It is particularly unfair that this practice continues between elections. Since 2018, the BC NDP and Liberals each received approximately $800,000 to $1 million in per vote subsidies. Collectively, they also received $3.5 million in expense reimbursements during the last election alone. These expenses were travel and advertising, including those attack ads. And I'm compelled to ask, why is this on the back of the taxpayer and the voter? And if you do deem it to be fair, why do only establishment parties receive it? In effect, this practice has silenced small party, silences and small party new and independent voices. So where's the democracy in that? If these subsidies and expense reimbursements were eliminated, all parties and independent candidates would answer to their donors for how the money is spent. Instead, currently, parties are freely spending to further partisan ambitions, knowing full well that the taxpayer will be forced to pick up the tab later. It's unconscionable to me that political parties can legislate funds directly to themselves. I asked the committee to speak to eliminating the per vote subsidy as well as ending taxpayer funded expense reimbursements for political parties. I thank you for your time and attention to this.